Oil is trading lower amid a rise in U.S. crude inventories. The U.S. dollar is extending gains against the ruble. Crude prices went down on Wednesday amid a surprising increase in U.S. oil stockpiles and worries over the coronavirus spread in Europe. In the morning session, Brent futures fell by 1.03 percent to trade at $41.29 per barrel, while WTI crude lost 1.23 percent and settled at $39.31 per barrel. A steep rise in new coronavirus cases in France and Spain renewed concerns about the global fuel demand. What's more, the UK authorities consider implementing additional lockdown restrictions in the country. Meanwhile, the American Petroleum Institute reported on Tuesday that crude inventories in the U.S. surged last week, whereas gasoline stockpiles declined by 8 million barrels. In the early trade on the Moscow exchange, the U.S. dollar average weighted rate went up against the ruble and settled at 76.35. Compared to the same period yesterday, the dollar advanced by 834 points. The local low was set at 76.20, while the high was seen at 76.44. Overall, more than 9,000 deals were opened on the pair, with the total trading volume of 46 billion rubles. This number corresponds to the average data recorded in September. The dollar-ruble pair was last seen trading at the level of 76.4. Notably, since April 15 of 2003, the Bank of Russia has been setting the official dollar to ruble exchange rate according to the average rate that the US dollar trades at in the morning session on the Moscow exchange. Future dynamics of the ruble will be determined by the preliminary data on the services and manufacturing PMI in Europe and the US. The fresh macroeconomic data may influence an investors' appetite towards risk assets. On the energy front, Eurasia Group consulting firm warns that global oil demand will be down by more than 10 percent compared to the previous year and will amount to around 90 million barrels per day due to the COVID-19 crisis. That's all for now. Thank you for watching and stay tuned.